The bike park here in Silver is pretty spectacular. And there's something going clunk on there. It's gonna be a long, hot climb. Nine thirty six. Call up, gentlemen. Have fun. Good luck, guys. something going clunk on there and it's hard to tell if maybe it's just the brake like the brake pads down here but it's very disconcerting when I'm trying to race so I noticed it yesterday and I was like oh maybe I'm just tired but I noticed it again this morning on the first run so I'm gonna swap this out real quick and then head up the gondola for the next one All right, up here at the top of stage two, right over there. Probably the shortest one of the weekend. Um, got a sweet drop, step up kind of thing. Um, I'm a little bit behind my category at the moment just because I swapped my fork out. But uh, yeah, you know, should be fine. It doesn't look like there's a big line, so should be able to have plenty of time and drop when I want to and should be fun. Here we go. That was stage number two, which is like, I don't know, it's fun. Got some sweet jumps and drops and a bunch of holes in the corners. Oh, hanging out with these goofballs back there. <clears throat> and we just found out that we have to climb from this one to the start of the last one, which honestly is news to me. I guess I should have looked at the map a little bit more carefully. I thought that that first climb was our only one. So, got some climbing to do, I guess. I think maybe I'll stop and take my uh, cheek pads out because climbing in a full face kind of sucks. Yeah, man. Thank you. Well, that wraps up the day. Three stages, two climbs, one of which I wasn't expecting, um, but just some really fun stages. The, the bike park here in Silver is pretty spectacular. I mean, just a great mix of terrain, different like climates, um, a tall mountain. It's, I believe it's like 2,200 feet of descent, which is pretty awesome. Um, and it, it's long. Like I think that last stage was like 17 minutes or something ridiculous. So good long stages, good times. Um, my fork feels better now that I swapped it out. And yeah, I'm going to go chip in and go sit in the river and drink a recovery drink and get ready for tomorrow. Got another big one then too. 
slightly later start this morning, so it's already getting warm, so we're gonna go sit in the river in the morning. Dylan's really excited about it. <laughs> uh. oh. Woo. Yep. Nice and cool. I'm gonna have to put the plugs in, but I just fucking hate this part. Ah. I don't know oh. how you do that. Woo. It, it oh. went in! <laughs> it went in! <laughs> okay, I'm alright. <laughs> It's gonna be a long, hot climb. I am not messing around. I'm gonna try to cool down beforehand. Me too, Dilly. Oh, that's gonna poison it. <laughs> oh, that was your gloves, Forrest. No, they're gonna dry. <laughs> that's a good point. Mackey's is rejecting water. <laughs> Can you scrub it a little bit too? Thanks, buddy. Uh, oh, yeah. That's gonna be good. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> Not in. Just on. That was the first stage of the day, stage four. Uh-oh, we're out of water, that's sad. Um, that climb was long, it was like almost three hours and pretty solid, pretty warm, so cooled down a couple of times, but that stage went pretty well. I think I uh, hit things pretty much the way I meant to and it was pretty smooth and yeah, we'll see, but my fork feels way better today. I think my rebound was just super fast yesterday and it was like, making terrible noises and chattering around and it was bad so yeah I'm pleased. What? <laughs> All right y'all have fun out there. Right, have fun, Mackie. Mackie. Be safe ride fast. Ride, ride, ride. Thanks, man. Keep it going. <sighs> Damn. That was a hard one. About 13 and a half minutes. Full on. Try to pump the corners. Pedal where you can. Oh man, that was hard. I guess that's the race. We will see result wise. I'm sure hoping I was able to make up some time, some spots. I needed 20 seconds to make it onto the podium, which hard. People are riding well, but uh, felt a lot better today than I did yesterday. Fork feels good. Um, that's about it. That course is rad. 
quarter of the way down. I don't know, part way down. Um, my pedals or my chain got jammed. I was like, uh-oh. And then I like backpedaled a little bit and left it for a second and then it was okay, but now my shifter's not working, so. This thing should be lighting up when I hit those. And the battery's obviously connected, so I'll know what's going on, but fortunately it's the last stage. A little bit hard being in the hardest gear the whole, well, three quarters of the way down. That was rough. According to this piece of paper here, I am currently seventh, moved up one spot, but one of the guys who was around me has not chipped in yet. So hopefully we'll see. Party time! River time. Ice bath, ice bath. This is some kind of really bad dance move. How's the water, guys? Oh, it's wonderful. It's wonderful. Oh, going in, the water's fine. Mighty fine. Wow, that was a busy, awesome weekend. Bunch of good people, great trails. The riding up here at Silver Mountain is awesome. Um, I didn't quite make the podium. Seventh, um, which I'll take. And at least I broke my eighth place streak. <laughs> um, now I get to load everything up, pack up the van, and start driving. Gotta be in Salt Lake City by 5 p.m. tomorrow. It's a 10 hour drive, so try to get a couple hours tonight finish it off tomorrow, drop some stuff off, and uh, get ready to fly to Vermont. So, it's gonna be kind of lonely because Sid's not here, she's uh, already in Ohio, but me a long 10 hours. But just a little bit here to get the van packed up and then get out of here.